Dear students, uh, let's discuss question number 22 that is comprised of 5 marks. Uh, what is meant by power of a lens? Define its SI unit. You have two lenses A and B of focal lens plus 10 centimeter and minus 10 centimeter. That's a hint uh, guys. Uh, if the focal length, your uh, focal length is plus 10 centimeter, if that means it, it is positive and if it is positive, it will be your converging lens. That means it is what your convex lens and if the focal length is negative there is a hint that it means it is diverging lens that is uh, it's a concave lens state the nature and power of each lens which of the two lenses will form a virtual and magnified image of an object placed 8 centimeter again important point guys 8 centimeter that means your uh, you know object is in between principal focus and optical center of that lens draw a ray diagram to justify your answer so uh, we'll go one by one what is meant by power of a lens the ability of a lens to converse or diverse the light rays falling on it and you know that it is a reciprocal of focal length of the lens so quite theoretical question uh, so we are done with this and you will be awarded one mark for that define its si unit so you know the si unit of uh, power of a lens is diopter and one diopter is basically what it is the power of a lens whose focal length is what one meter for that you will get half marks now uh, moving forward state the nature and power of each lens uh, right so uh, in in first case fa is what plus 10 centimeter you know that power of a lens is inversely proportional to the uh, uh, focal length so p equals to 1 by f so you see here p a equals to 1 by f a that is your lens a so it is 1 upon 0 0.1 meter and that will come what 10 diopter and and if you want to take it in centimeter in that case what you have to do 100 upon focal length in what centimeter that will give you the same answer right so we are using it in terms uh, you, we are first converting this focal length into meter because it is 1 by f a if you will use it 100 by FA, then you can take FA in what? In terms of centimeter, right? So this is what your 10D, FB is minus 10 centimeter. So that is again minus 0 0.1 meter diverging or con that is concave lens already discussed that uh, your power of that lens will be 1 upon FB that is 1 upon minus 0 0.1 meter that is minus 10D. So we are done up to this point. We have uh, mentioned the nature and power of each lens. Now, which of the two lens will form a virtual? Now, virtual it's fine, uh, but magnified also. So that means if it is virtual and magnified, guys, it will be convex lens, right? And, and you can see here also that your object is in between optical center and principal focus of the lens. That means it is what your convex lens will form what? Your uh, virtual and magnified image of the object, right? So for that, you will get half marks and, and you draw this diagram. So for that, you will get what one mark. Uh, this is very uh, simple. Your object is here in between your principal focus and optical center. And uh, one light is going, uh, you know, parallel to the uh, principal axis. So I hope you know that it will pass through this F2 and you uh, one is what going through the optical center. It will go without any deviation. So just uh, uh, they are not meeting. Really, they are not meeting. So just, uh, you know, Mm, extend that in a backward direction and you will get what one virtual image and you can see here it is what you're magnified so you are getting virtual as well as magnified image of the object when you are putting an object in between optical center and principal focus in case of convex lens i hope it is clear to all of you thank you